Welcome back. Deputy Collector of Marmogao has issued eviction notices to 47 illegal structures. These structures are along the Baina beach side. Following warning of, of soil erosion along the seaside, the residents have been asked to evacuate the houses within 24 hours. But there is no rehabilitation plan. The residents have threatened to give up their lives to protect their hutmits if possibly evicted. I'm voting for Tamchi Gawan Kaitsna, I'm voting for Angatsasa, I'm the ration card Angatsasa, I'm the Burgundy certificate Angatsasa, Shara Angat Chiklasa, I'm a Kay Hoteliata, what's my lar? I'm a Bure Duk Zalela Sata, Tin Dizale, I'm Jona, Kaina, Ashes are yellow, Karizale, I'm a Anga Jew de Tele, Bartele, Panami Kali Karchen, I'm the secretary help for Unda. These residents have no other shelter. I'm a Kayas, I'm Kayasna. Germorai to me, Kite Korai. अंगे बाइल बुरी हाथ सगड़ा, अमी सार के नित्तानी, पोली हम का उड़ाया नहीं, घर मगर मोड़ा है। Revenue authorities have issued notices to 47 households in wake of soil erosion. हम का उसे इनपुट से जाके हंगाजर दे सो जो सो soil erosion जला तो सो entire beach वहाँ सा पड़े, हंगाजर कहीं erosion जाऊँ शक्ता मनु नहीं थोड़े लोकानी चीज़ घर मल लेती सार के beach आर दरियान मल लें। अगर लोगों जी 47 तो इलीगल स्ट्रक्चर से चली तंग कर 47 इलीगल स्ट्रक्चर का हमें एविक्शन अच्छा नोटिसेस दिलाया विकेट करा मनोज विदिन 24 आर्स ना जरूर वी आर गोइंग टू फोर्सफुली एविक्ट देम बट रेजिडेंट्स आर पैनिक दे डिमांड रिहैबिलिटेशन अगर हम इतने वर्षों इंगा हाँ तो संगता हम क तो हम तुम इंगुस तुमको जाए जागो जाए नू हमको होए नहीं तो हमके सुविधा दी है ना बाहर कड़ा है तेरे सामने राम का लागना है मंडरता हो कलेक्टर आन। When Mira questioned the deputy collector about rehabilitation, he got confused. We are going to provide them temporary shelter. We are arranging for that. But that was not planned. तेरे कोरोनो सामी मंगे रिविक्शन करता है। But we are already issued a 24 hour deadline. Deadline ना मैं immediately के लिए नहीं किरा काम का तो शे input सोचा कि there is possibility of further erosion. No, before but before we will provide them. We will provide them. ताकि लग काटूं ना मैं नगर रस्ते दूर चलना we are going to provide them and that time हमारा मैं नगर shift करता है weekend करता है. Deadline ही तो. Oh. Reported the Shant Parab for Prudent. Uruguay defeated Italy by a solitary goal on Tuesday night to enter the pre-quarter finals of FIFA World Cup Brazil. The shock victory was overshadowed by an alleged bite by star striker Luis Suarez. In another important match, Greece knocked out Ivory Coast by two goals to one and moved into the round of 16. Elsewhere, Colombia thrashed Japan 4-1, while England held Costa Rica to a goalless draw. Uruguay will take on Colombia while Greece will clash with Costa Rica in pre-quarters. Gomes Sports Academy Managing Director Ashley Gomes is optimistic about revamping the motocross scenario in the state. A state delegation led by Fisheries Minister Avarteno Furtado had visited UK in August 2012. As Chief Minister Manohar Parikar harbors the dream of making Goa an adventure sports tourist destination. Almost two years since that foreign trip to witness the GP of Great Britain, MX promoters Gomes has clarified that the state delegation had a fruitful meeting. Since then, almost a year and a half has gone by and not much has happened for the sport, especially from the outside. But let me tell you that from the inside, the sport of MX has progressed by leaps and bounds and is almost on the verge of exploding in a very big way. We have worked out the modalities and other details. And after several discussions with the Honorable CM, we have placed our final proposal before the government to launch the MX Championship in November 2014, with round two in December, followed by final round in January 2015. We have been in constant touch with this progress as planned by both the sides, that is the sporting and the logistics. The proposal is in its final stages of approval from the SAG, that's the Sports Authority of Goa, who would have anyway declared the good news of the restart of MX in Goa by the first half of July, as the championship needs to be declared at least four months in advance so the riders and teams can prepare for the same. But unfortunately, MX was mistakenly equated as a junket and as such, we holding the responsibility and aspirations of thousands of MX fans across India had no other option but to clear the air and to reiterate their hopes that yes, Goa is headed in the right direction and their dreams to witness live the FIM Motocross World Championship in their own country will come true soon.
And with this, we come to an end of this news bulletin. Keep watching Prudent. You are watching Prudent.